Hello guys, this is Nilesh Kamre and in this video we are going to see how to troubleshoot issue related to we could not complete the install because an update service was shutting down. So we are going to see different methods and you can follow all the troubleshooting methods one by one. There could be possibility your issue would be resolved by any one of the method. I have given timestamp in the description if you want to follow particular method you can follow from the video. So let's go ahead and start the troubleshooting. Before going ahead I would like to say on this channel you would get stuff related to Windows 10, Active Directory Group Policy, Windows Server Operating System troubleshooting steps and technology reviews and its updates. So please hit the subscribe and press the bell icon to enable notifications for future videos. Method number one is to reboot the computer. Windows issues most probably solves rebooting computers and you should first try this option. If your issue does not resolve, then you have to follow another methods. Method number two is to restart the service and to restart the service we have to press windows key plus R on the keyboard to open the run box type services.msc hit enter click any of the service press W on your keyboard it would take you to the services starting with W and then you have to find out windows update service. Now this update service is currently stopped and it is not currently started. So what I am going to do is right click on the service and then go to properties. Click on the startup type and hit the option that is automatic. Click on apply and start the service. Click on ok. Now you can check if the issue is resolved or not. If the issue is not resolved we have to follow another method. And the another method is to open command prompt type cmd in the search box click on run as administrator click on yes you have to open command prompt with administrative rights to run this command type sfc space forward slash scan now and hit enter this process is going to take some time we have to wait for this process to complete we have to check if issue is resolved or not and then issue is not resolved we have to follow another method you can see sfc space scan now process is complete and it is found some issues and corrupt files are there and successfully repaired them we don't have to follow anything beyond this we just have to check if the issue is resolved or not if the issue is not resolved we have to follow another method type cmd in the search box click on run as administrator click on yes type dism dot exe space cleanup hyphen image space forward slash online space forward slash restore health hit enter this process is going to take some time you have to wait for this process to complete once this process is complete reboot the computer and check if issue is resolved or not another method is to run the troubleshooter and to run the troubleshooter we have to right click on windows go to settings click on the update and security click on troubleshoot scroll down and you would see windows update click on the run the troubleshooter and it would start identifying the issues related to windows updates and try to fix the issue So Windows Update Troubleshooter found some issues and we can just hit the apply this fix. So currently it is saying that broadband modern issues and you can check over here that I do not have any internet connection on this machine. So I am going to skip this step and we'll check if other issues are there on this particular machine. So most probably it is giving me resolutions related to internet connection and and don't want to connect this machine to internet if you're having this issues you can just connect to internet and check if the issue is resolving or not windows update requires internet connection 
but for this machine i am not going to give internet so i'm just going to close the troubleshooter and i hope these troubleshooting methods would help you to resolve this issue and if you like this video please hit the like button please hit the subscribe and press the bell icon to enable notifications for future videos thanks and bye bye